After all we've been through, do we still love RV life? Find out next. Welcome to the channel. I'm Liz. And I'm Paul. And these are exciting times to push past fear, build confidence, and live amazing. And it is time to live amazing. Regular viewers know that we have been through a lot. <laughs> Yep, we've well, had our trials and tribulations. We're not going to uh, go back into that again. We just wanted to make a happy video because there's been a lot of downer. There's been some stress and stuff. And if you don't know, Paul and I have been on the road almost three years now, full yeah, time. Yeah, October 18th will be my three year anniversary. Yeah, that's right. And the answer is we do still love RV life. I mean, any kind of life is gonna have its ups and downs. Nothing is all roses. So if you're thinking about joining us and doing RV life, know that it, like anything, it's not gonna be roses and butterflies every time. Not every time. It, things will happen and uh, you just have to roll with it. So where we are right now is in Montana. We're in uh, West Glacier and right just outside of the uh, Glacier National Park. And we have some good news for you. Um, you know, there's been a lot of rumors around that campgrounds are full, campgrounds are full, you can't get a reservation. Well, we had to make our reservations last minute and yeah. all of our reservations are under a month old. We were able to get close to the National Park. We're just a few miles outside yeah. of Glacier yeah. National Park. Um, and we were able to continue making our reservations. We're and booked until the end of the year, really. So my advice for you is if you call a place and they're full, don't give up, just call another place. This actually, you know, was like the fourth place that we yeah, called. Yeah, this was not the first place we called in, in uh, West Glacier. And don't get discouraged, just like Liz said, just call the next place and, and you will find a spot. Yeah, because we want to see you out there. We want to see you enjoying it. We don't want you to feel like you can't go this year because the campgrounds really are not full. No, the one we're at here, um, I would say it's less than half full. Mm -hmm. I mean, there, there's a number of open spots around us. And we're driving by campgrounds now. We do know the KOA here is full, but we have driven downtown and we've, we're past campgrounds and they don't look packed. No, there's still spots for people to, to come and, and visit this beautiful location i mean geez this is why we do this life we'll talk about what we've done what what's the highlight of what we've done in west glacier we rode up the uh going to the sun road on our e-bikes and man am i glad i had an e-bike it is but it's just spectacular to, to see i mean just the views are are breathtaking so a couple times a year before the going to the sun road is open in glacier to traffic to car traffic they open it to hikers and bikers mm -hmm. so we got in now the road is now open but we got in before the road opened they'll do it again in october when they close it to traffic they'll open it to bicyclists and hikers you can bring an e-bike and it was just one of those life highlights wasn't it yeah it really was and if you're thinking about doing it you want to do it when there's no vehicle traffic on the road because there are a couple of blind turns and uh yeah it just it was i don't see it ending well for <laughs> somebody coming down the mountain at you know 30 miles an hour and and meeting head up with head on with a you know the red bus or something right well i don't even think that they allow bikes yeah they there. probably close it to cyclists after after it's open to vehicles but i don't i don't know if you have been with us any length of time you know that we answer every single comment and we have been doing that since day one so now we're almost two years in and in the last week or two we couldn't keep up it's just the 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 number is just overwhelming it's a thousand comments a week i mean we love you thank you for we still read every comment just know that, that we do thank you for having us grow so fast yeah. the channel's not even two years old we're you know thirty-eight thousand subscribers so what we've done because there are some people that want to connect more with us and interact with us personally and you know share photos and stuff we have created a patreon absolutely all of our content will always be free but if you want more if you want to share photos and comments uh, one of the levels of patreon comes with a facebook so you can upload pictures and you can connect with us you can find out where we are you can show photos of your camper you can do meetups and that kind of thing so it's yeah. just an option but yeah, it's just an option but just know that that this content will always be free we're always going to do videos and put them on youtube and it's totally free and we're always gonna read every comment. Yep. Unfortunately, not able to answer every comment anymore, but we're always gonna read every comment. And thank you again. This community that we have built, the A-Team, absolutely blows us away with what we learn, the support and love we get from you. 
it, it's yeah, really I, been wonderfully overwhelming. I want to speak to that actually. I, I, I just want, I didn't respond to everybody or not very many people, but I did read all your comments about the, your condolences for, to, uh, because of my brother's passing. And I just want you to know it just, it warmed my heart. It, um, I'm getting chills talking about it. So just know that I read them and thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you all so much. And we hope you're out here living life, you know, because really if our channel has anything at all, it's about living life to the fullest, whether you're camping or boating this weekend or just out enjoying life. That's what we want for you. And we have lots of big things coming, so we can't wait to share those with you and we'll see you in the next video. Yeah, see you next time around.